good evening. So it's about quarter to seven at night and I'm at Binzi. It's going to be a beautiful evening so I've come here for sunset but it should be about ten to nine. The heather's out in full bloom as it's the middle of August so I'm just in a short local walk to my, my favourite little mini mountain, little mini hill. The views on top of Binzi are exceptional. You can see right over to the Scarfell Pikes. You can see the coast because it's the most northern Wainwright and it has no mountains on its north and west side. So it's spectacular for sunset. You get the sunset over the, the Irish Sea and the Solway over to Scotland and uh, the view that we just show you of Skiddar and Bussonset Lake Bussonset Lake there, Skiddar Whitewater Dash Overwater and the Oldell Hills exceptional isn't it? So it only takes about 20 minutes to get to the top of Binzi from where you park the car you can make it a little bit of a small circular if you head around the flanks of its western side you keep the view of Bussonset Lake and you come to Billy's Rock we'll show you his rock when we get there where he likes to survey his kingdom and then you can just nip across to the summit through the heather or you can just go straight up 20 minutes to the top straight back down, entirely up to you. I would class it as probably the most easiest Wainwright to do. Good one to start with. And you can't beat the views, you really can't. So I'd like to take you along and show you how exceptional this little tiny hill is. Hope you come with me. Catch you in a bit. Rock. Up. Surveying his kingdom. <laughs> Looking over to the Solway and Scotland, you can see Criffle in the far distance, eventually leading to the Irish Sea. The light on these fields, I just love the pattern of these fields. There's that Murthy over there. Bus 
a bit like Scarfell Pikes right over there and the Langdale Pikes and beautiful Skidder. That's the summit of Finzi, where you've got a trig and a shelter and a cairn. of Binzi. view over Corbett Common and over the Solway in the distance you'd have Gretna over there you've got the Pennines to the right hand side in the far far distance the view of Scotland from this cairn it's worth doing a detour to this other little cairn to get the view north. Wow. There you go, the Solway, Criffle.
head back to the car now. It's about 20 minutes back to the car. I'm going to end the video here. I hope you enjoy this epic sunset. I'd say you get a fantastic sunset on this vale, and you also get a sunrise over Skiddor. You've got uninterrupted views of the coast, over all the way up to the Scarfells, Bustonfit Lake. It really is an epic little fowl. I hope you enjoy this video. Thank you all for watching. Bye for now. just text me to say that there's supposed to be an aurora tonight so I come back up Binzi <laughs> and I'm hoping to catch an aurora um, it's been red alert for ages and it's just gone to amber so I'm hoping I'm still gonna get it so yeah so I've got a slice of pizza I've got some carrot cake and I've still got my flask of coffee I'm going to maybe stay up here an hour, wait for it to get really, really dark. And uh, yeah, let's hope I, get it. I catch it. <laughs>